VFL coach Jeremy Laidler. Like Jeremy, can you give an update to fans about how the VFL side have gone so far this year? Yeah, so we've had uh, a fair few practice matches because um, our season doesn't start until round five of the AFL. So uh, we've been lucky enough to play the Giants over and over, but um, yeah, we're really getting to know them as opposition. So um, I suppose the benefit is playing footy uh, in Sydney. So we've played a few games out at their ground, and then on the weekend we played out at Lakeside, which was really pleasing. Um, We've sort of had to adjust a little bit with new rules coming into the, um, into the VFL, but um, it's just sort of trying to implement that as well as getting the connection from the VFL squad players to the AFL listed players. And I've been really pleased with how they've adapted and how they've connected. What's been your observation in terms of how the VFL squad and the new players have transitioned uh, playing and training alongside the senior players? Yeah, we've been really lucky. We've been able to try and get the VFL listed players in the AFL system as much as we can. So um, they've got a great, we've got a great group of VFL boys, but... Um, I suppose hats got, hat goes off to all the AFL listed players. They've made them feel so welcome and uh, been really open with how they want to learn and how they want to teach them as well. So um, I think I had nine VFL listed players play on the weekend and you couldn't tell who was AFL or VFL. So um, from my side of things, the relationships have been great. You've mentioned a couple of those AFL listed players, uh, the likes of Will Haywood, who have had an opportunity to play in the VFL. Uh, what have you made of their performances recently? Yeah, I've got a few guys that have played a little bit of senior footy playing in the VFL at the moment. Um, Will Haywood come back and his attitude was second to none and he just needed to find some form and play with a bit of freedom and I suppose on the weekend he did that and he looked um, he looked like a class above really and just the way he was getting up and back and flying at the ball was really pleasing. So he's definitely putting his hand up for selection. Um, I suppose the others got Dill Stevens, who's been playing a little bit inside, a little bit on the wing and um, just his run and carry has been really noticeable. Uh, and then you've got the likes of Sam Gray, Ryan Clark, who are continually just putting up good performances and always putting their hand up for selection. Um, I suppose down back, Lewis Malikin come back from missing a week. Uh, he just went, went about his business and defended really well. Uh, and then up forward, Hayden McLean was unlucky to miss out last week with big Lance Franklin coming back in, but um, he just kept his standards up and played some really good football. A lot of players have come through the QBE Sydney Swans Academy as well. What have you made of their transition into senior football? I guess it's a real testament to the program and how players have been able to aspire to play senior, le senior level footy. Yeah, we've got a few of the QBE Swans Academy players playing with the VFL squad. Um, I suppose the benefit is that we've got them around and um, from a young age we can sort of teach them the way we want to teach them and um, build them up, up the ranks. And um, A few of them come through like the academy and then went to other clubs um, to play some senior football and then with the VFL competition coming back and us having a, our own squad um, well enabled, enabled us to get them back around the club and um, like I said before the benefit of us training with the senior squad as much as we can I suppose that's the best way of learning when you're out on the track and um, learning from some of the best at AFL level. And just lastly what's the focus moving forward ahead of the new season? I suppose in the practice matches we're just trying to implement um, the AFL game plan and structures as best we can because I want to get them back into seniors or up into the seniors and play seniors, senior football as quick as we can. Um, and then for the VFL guys, it's trying to get them to play the way we want to and learn the structures as quick as we can because we don't get them 24-7 like we do the AFL boys. But um, they've been really um, good at trying to learn and pick my brain, pick my, you know, get on my computer and watch vision. And um, I couldn't be more pleased with how they're going about it. So uh, we've still got another, another couple of practice matches leading into round one. So um, we'll just keep learning on the go. Best of luck. Enjoy the season. Thank you.